does it make us feel complete to abuse other people to belittle them and make them feel like they do not deserve to be here they not like us um toby lepel's kosana today i'm addressing an issue which has been affecting a lot of people from different spheres of the world in different ways it's about bullying uh if you went to school you know what bullying feels like um it starts from being teased from how you look how you speak uh what you wear um sometimes it's your hair your color skin your accent uh, how you walk and it is so hurting when it is associated with how God created you. Today I have a video of a girl who was attending a school in Venda. It was being assaulted by another student. And later she decided to commit suicide. This is the video guys. And it's it's going to be silent as you can see invisible a little bit because i want to emphasize on a lot of things a lot of aspects is it okay for someone to take their life because of someone who's trying to take control on their lives because if you look at this I'm not sure what was the story behind everything. Um, I, I'm not sure what was happening on her head. Maybe she couldn't take it anymore. I can think of it when you cannot stand your peers anymore. You don't seem to connect with them. You come to school with an intention to study. But they treat you otherwise, not knowing why. Maybe they think it's the best for them to become popular in the school or become, I don't know, they are the ones who are responsible for their actions. But is taking your life the best solution? Uh, other people would say you can take advice, you can go for a there's something which is going to appear in the screen right now. You can go for these things. You can do counseling. You okay, A lot of things you can do in order to ease pain. But sometimes when you are faced with depressing moments, with situations that you cannot mm -hmm. fully take control over, we tend to... Don't think straight, guys. Um... We don't think straight under pressure, which is why people take bad decisions. So, watching this video, it is so hurting. I don't know the story behind, but I was hurt in such a way that I even had a comment that if it was my daughter or son or my relative, I was going to have a chat with these people. I, I, I work a lot with understanding uh what were you thinking when you were doing that what was in your mind maybe we can help other people to fix that because there are always symptoms there are always signs towards doing something and then lastly as you can see uh, we don't know what was going on in the mind of lufuno as she wrote whatever she wrote and this is the trans the translation from she went to e English. Um, it's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. And I think parents are not doing enough to teach their children uh, about originality. Because I think this thing of hating one another, it comes from being intimidated by someone's originality or trying to boost your own originality, guys. And I think also the curriculum, the school curriculum should be work so much hand in hand with life because i once went to school i'm gonna be honest I, I, there are there are subjects that that are meant to help students in order for them to live a easier life but those those subjects are somehow depressing as a business person they are business related uh, subjects but 
other subjects just made me feel like the only option for me to survive in life is to be employed and uh, not how to um, to create employment which is why most of us are, to, are too dependent to the doctor so there's a lot i would like to say in this short uh, six minute video i would just say uh, let's try let us try to change the mindset of our children let's try to educate children on how is bullying going to if affect both the one who is being bullied and the bully and the group of the surroundings because when you go home we can do something uh, all together but when you go home you're gonna feel regrets you're gonna be alone and you're gonna know that you you did something which you were not supposed to do also let's teach children how to survive life because it's about survival let's try to teach them to be job creators instead of making them become uh, job seekers because everyone is seeking a job without a solution we are all creating problems without a solution uh rest in peace to lufuno it is so sad it is so sad guys uh it is so sad i can't even comment or speak about it uh emphasize it more but it is so sad we all saw the video but now i feel it is more sad because i feel like we're not doing enough as a country how does one grow hate on each other so much so much that you guys um let me leave it here um i hope justice is served for lufuna also i hope that families find peace it's hard for me to find peace but i know that there is going to be a way there there are plans for everything so let's go and try to educate our children about how this sensitive this thing sensitive it is um yeah i'm so heartbroken 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 um yeah i was just commenting guys hope you enjoyed the video thank you so much